1963 Pontiac Grand Prix, what I believe to be a 389 engine, beautiful car, four-speed car, eight lugger, um, stunning car. Had a myriad of drivability problems. First and foremost, had to go through the carb. It's a Carter AFB, nice carburetor. It had been re rebuilt before. Um, found three or four things wrong with it. In particular, there's a check valve that operates with the accelerator pump was stuck shut. I'm sure that was uh, contributing to what the owner said was, you know, very poor acceleration, poor drivability. Uh, points were burnt to a crisp. We're not finished here, but we have a pretty good tune on it. Um, the carburetor base gasket had a leak. So right now we're at the point where um, everything's put back together. I dialed it in close. I like to use a vacuum gauge. We'll talk about that in a minute. If you ever watch Uncle Tony, that's how he does it too. Um, and we can see if she's in tune or not in one moment. Turn the key on. Now, a carbureted engine is in tune, warmed up. When I hit the starter switch, this thing should start right up and idle. Just like that, okay? So, didn't need to add fuel, nothing like that. Um, like I said, I do my tuning with the vacuum gauge, and on this engine, it comes from right at the edge, it's upside down, I see that. But if we're right on the edge of 18, we're fine. There, there's no vacuum leaks on this. And setting mixture screws, um, you watch carefully my idle mixture as soon as I hit the unhappy spot see the vacuum drops right down I'm gonna bring it up just a little bit until she's smooth then another half a turn for good measure and again like I said I already did all this um, check the timing with the uh, vacuum advanced disconnected and we are around nine, which is okay for a you know street car to go up a little higher, but for now that's good enough. So there you have it. Um nice and tuned, very snappy. <laughs> right back down to idle. Still need to do a little more work on this thing. Um, I need to put the steel fuel filter in that has the return to the tank. Uh, having a hard time finding a 3 8 on that. It's just getting an electric choke. So there you have it. Can't wait to take this thing out for a test drive. Be well.